horrible deaths. Uh, so that's just what yes. you're going to hear when you start. Yes, so you've managed Hello. to crash land into Yavin Station. Oh, come, come on. on. We didn't make it onto the recording. There was we not landed. a crash landing. The landing was, was fine. It was the speed of the landing that was the issue. We just got shot a few times on the way down. Only one. <laughs> Have we actually been shot yet? Yeah, we yes, took we one did. hit on the landing, and that was pretty much it. Yeah, we That's a very high roll. We didn't something. trigger either. No. Well, we don't have duty to trigger. Uh, oh, I added some in. You have six points. Combat victory oh. and enemy demoralization. Uh, with but seven people, we probably want to do half. Yeah, probably. Half today. Probably, yeah. So, one, two, three, four. Four dark side. Well, two dark Five side. light. Uh, so three yeah, light. Dark side. So that's yeah. Yep. There we go. Oh, very yep. nice. Uh, fairly balanced. So you're inside a kind of protective, um, like force field bubble. But um, we need that map. Oh yeah, I have to actually share it. Duh. <laughs> sorry, all you have made sure you're actually recording yourself. This yes, time. I can see that I'm recording my voice this week. I'm sorry for last week. <laughs> I Are you sure you're recording it all? Yes, I can see it. I just it isn't it one the old days it. when the recording just stopped for no reason. And you didn't realise until the end. No, I can actually see what's <laughs> going on. Unfortunately, I just didn't look at it last week. Rest in peace, uh, Dungeon World finale. Yeah. Oh. yeah. I was thinking of the Warp Storm episode from Rogue Trader, but it yeah, happened. Yeah, we, we had quite a few. That's why we moved away from Fraps. So many episodes just like, oh... Apparently, this file that's apparently said it's been recording for two or three hours has not been recording for three hours. Well, <sighs> but no, we are recording. I okay. will be. Is it? I'll be right back before we get fully started. But keep going. I'm not going to miss much. Right. Right. So we have landed. Haven't we? You have landed, and you know there's kind of enough. There's basically a force field that's giving air to this area. Soon after we're about like getting. Annihilated by the um, gravity of the uh, planet, uh, or the, the wind, the wind or and stuff possibly like that. the atmospheric makeup. It's a magic. It's a magic force bubble. Oh, oh please! There's no Jedi involved that we know of. It's not magic. magic. They, they, you see them all the time in Star Wars. Mm -hmm. You actually do, to be fair. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we landed on one of the pads. I'm guessing I'm, there must be some sort of airlock out of us, right? Yeah. Right, so we'll right underneath the um. Sorry. Get, uh, right. I think he's just adjusting the ship. Right underneath the bridge. There you go. The ship isn't facing where the bridge was. All right. In that case, let's just we jump out and get through um, as soon as possible. No, you haven't locked token scale. Apparently not. In that case, Jarzilla rides again. Jar. <laughs> if you get big, yeah, once right, more, you're gonna back. get swept off the platform. Oh, wow. Okay. Wait, is this the Look. whole station, or is this like a defensive platform? This oh, I think this is the station. This is the level that we landed on, according to Gray. It extends up and down. Ah, yeah. okay. So we can expect a big fight? Almost that. Probably. Thankfully, we well, none of us are really hurt. Yeah, we None probably... of us have been hit. Yes. That was pretty much exactly what happened. I mean, Hilo had a brief encounter with gravity due to a failing basket, but that's pretty much it. That was I'm, still I'm still laughing at the fact that you're just a horrific murder dinosaur. <laughs> I will change that at some point. <laughs> well, if the shoe fits. Well, yeah. <laughs> if the sh Ooh, well, right, that was a poor have a contingent of marines on the ship? What, your ship? Mm. No. Damn, not no. It, it, won't, it won't help them. Frankly, anyway, even if we did, I would have argued they should defend the ship. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody added me to that map, so I added myself. Well, we all added Yeah. Added we, yeah. Well, so. That's okay. why Jar be, that's why Jar was Godzilla for a second. <laughs> so they haven't opened the front door. So um, of course not. They're they're out your pockets. They are playing that alarm sound, which is the Star Wars equivalent of, um, you know, trespassers will be brutally shot. Survivors will be shot again. 
and then pushed off to the glass giant. Prepare to repel borders. All right. Uh, well, we can either do this. We can either have, I guess, one of the techies hack it open, or we can just try and blow the bloody thing out. Or I, mean, I have the lightsaber. Well, lightsaber works actually. That's preferable. Blowing it open closed. I'd up. say we well, should probably ha try and hack it first, though. Yeah. I, I was going to say, like, do I see any terminals nearby? <laughs> I mean, I can do the hacking. Well, there's a way. Yeah, there's a normal door hack it. And also, yes, you will need to do a bit of hacking. Alright. The terminal uh, comes alive and strangles. Alright. Not it's not very stealthy hacking. But yeah, is, is, it, is, it, is it computers or is it, is there, would it be more mechanics? Or would um, it be a combination of both? Probably mechanics to breach it and then computers to actually hack it. Yeah. Alright. Hmm. So, a mechanics to get in, and then uh, computers to actually open the door? Yep. So, what's your intelligence, uh, Zeb? I've got, f for my computers check, I've got three yellow, one green, and two blue. Alright, uh, so you've got a four intellect? Yeah. Alright, so uh, you make the roll since I'll assist you. Uh, that'll be four yellows and one green. All right. What's the difficulty for this computers? Uh, four yellows and one green. Well, as you know, this is for the mechanics test. For the mechanics check. Uh, mechanics. Yeah. Oh. Check mechanics first. The computers. All right. Then mechanics would be four yellow or one green, right? Yeah. It's just gonna be average. Yep. Average check. Average. That's yeah. two purple. Uh. Let's see, any black dice for situation? Yeah. Black dice because you're kind of, you know, general stress. The fact you're on a platform over a jazz giant, if you fall off. They I'll already know we're here. <laughs> so have to. So two black, huh? Yep. Do you have anything that does things for black? I actually do not. All right, well, then we're going to roll these blacks. Well, the blacks didn't really matter in the end as it transpired, yeah. Yeah, the blacks. So, so, so what did the yeah. triumph do in terms of, like, getting access to it? Do we get access to, like, this is actually a proper way of, get, like, is it an actual terminal so it's not like you're we're just jury-rigging things together? Oh, yeah, complimentary <laughs> coffee. Reset to... Factory settings button. <laughs> you had to like find a paper to... clip. Yeah, I mean, I was that's say, possible. Like open this airlock. Would you like assistance? <laughs> yeah. No, I meant it was one of those little recessed reset buttons. Oh. Yeah. It's both it's Star Wars. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what would be something that this explosion would do for? Explosion. Well, mechanics check, really. Oh. Well, you can always have it so that you've managed to get access to a security terminal that allows for control of the interior doors as well as the airlock. Or the guy just left it unlocked. Like, the last person didn't bother to log out. Yeah, this, yeah. whatever you did now, just reset the software or something. Yeah, so you could... yeah, Jenkins was so tired of false alarms, he treated this as a false alarm as well and forgot to lock the door. So you can open, yeah. you can just open the door now about the computer's check. And we get a Sounds good to me. Yeah. Alright, breach team, get in, is it get in there? You got a boss. Breach yep. team being job. Say, <laughs> knock knock. No, oh, oh, that was wow. terrible. Oh, Still me. horrific murder dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, that was actually part of the reason I named the character Knock. So I was gonna say like, I, wasn't that the reason why you <laughs> named him that? He's the one who knocks. Well, he get... <laughs> yeah, the he, one he who also, knocks. He does also have a breaching tool. That too. I'm pretty sure he could use Knock as a breaching tool. All right, so Probably. He... These rooms, can't hit enough. Yeah, these rooms aren't empty, but at the scale of the map, I wasn't going to fill them with right, odds and sods. But, so, All right, so the door is, is open. It's not like we've caused an explosion or anything. No, this is a cargo hold with yeah, three entrances. Four if you count the one you came through. Is there anybody on the other side of the door? No. The... Hey, hey, is, is he, hey, uh... Tobias, while we're at it, can we try and like, uh, I think we can try and download the schematics to this place. We have no idea where we're going. 
Well, we could see the shape of it as we approached, so... Yeah, but we don't know where, where in here we want to... Oh, actually, what what yeah. are we doing here? Are we trying to, like, knock this facility out? Are we trying to steal stuff, or...? It was a bit of both. We were trying to find out what exactly was going on here, and then make the call to knock it out of the sky if we needed to. Yeah, we're trying to figure out what it is. I mean, honestly, we should we'll probably decide. knock it out either way. Yeah. yeah, but there could be something for us to steal, or something important, some important information or something. Yeah, so if nothing else, knowing what they were doing. Figure out what yeah. they're doing, and then blow up the reactor. Figure out what we're doing. We've run this gambit before, it worked out pretty well. So actually, Didn't yeah, if you can make a computer's check or something to have a look at the schematics, it'd be helpful. Because obviously, yeah, we yeah, know the general shape, but we don't know how the room is yeah. actually laid out. Last time we were dealing with a space station, it didn't go so well. I would yeah. say it could have gone worse. Well, remember Calculon started painting a bunch of geonosians out into space? No, I wasn't there for that session. <laughs> no, we're That's lucky. Uh, I was not there for that session, <laughs> yeah, too. You're both lucky. I'm uh, saying yeah. you just go straight ahead. Punch to the middle. I say, punch everything, even the, even the station itself. Just keep punching. Punch the doors, punch the floors, punch the crates, punch everything. <laughs> Java. Ooh, actually, yeah, we should probably check the crates. Are they oh, crates? Yeah, the crates. Oh, what is in this room? I was say, did we want to go to any of the side rooms, or are we just going to go straight for the center? We should probably check uh, the side rooms. We really should check the side rooms, to be honest. If like, nothing probably, else, we can just take an eye at. There's probably a lot more people here than we are. So, like, moving fast and hard is better than being slow and metaphorical. Yeah, we yeah, yeah. We take on that, is, that is also a good point. Yeah, but otherwise we could get surrounded. The other argument, though, is that if we all move as one, by the time we do what we need to do, we could find ourselves blocked off from getting back to the ship because we yeah. failed to clear out rooms behind us. That's what I mean. These are like guard stations or barracks or something. They fill in behind us. Oh, yeah, no, I'm agreeing with you. Yeah, and then we're trapped in the center by bad things. But equally, he does have a point. Splitting up here when massively outnumbered is probably not great. Yeah, I don't mean to do do just open the doors and have a look. If there's no people in there, move on. Yeah. yeah. If there's yeah. people in there, we 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 stop them from being in there. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll, deal with them. well, Zex is looking at the right. I'm looking at the left, and then someone with a very loud door, it seems. Yeah, and since so. we're in, I doubt that the other doors are locked the same way, so we can probably just open them until the alarm sh as he starts, anyways. Oh, well, the, the alarm's alarm already going. going. Yeah, <laughs> they they spot. They very much know we're here. The fact that uh, we actually got shot at means they were very much aware that we were coming yeah. for all that. The only way there. that they would know that we were here any more than they already do is if we were already shooting. Or broadcasting saying, hello! Hello, Which world! We, we are not quite crass enough to do. You mean Jar's not supposed to be having this conversation with the station commander? <laughs> and that's going on the performance review. <laughs> To be fair, John might be able to convince them to surrender. Oh, it's true. Maybe. So, you can uh, reach this... Or you may have given them enough time to turn the e web turrets on. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, open the one side door and then the other. Good call. Yep, yeah. okay. Not at the same time. Yeah, I shall. Um, and they get troop bracketed by fire. Oh god, Grey has added troopers. Well, it would be a bit weird if he put no resistance down whatsoever, to be honest. Imperial. He's using templates. Yeah. Let's actually, let's just delete that again. I why is it Imperial? I want you to use the Hut version, which is exactly the same. I, I think Hut is. Ex I think yes. I think Gray has accidentally revealed something. <laughs> <laughs> only I think the Fantasy Grounds Library. The only is very thing he's laid revealed out. is that he uses the same stats for. To be fair, generic troopers don't get that much different. Exactly, they're just they're oh. red shirts. If you'll forgive the pun. Yeah, well, I mean, honestly, is a uh, Republic Army troopers, Imperial Army troopers, and Hut Army troopers all probably should use the same stats, same thing as the commandos. It's a generic thing. Like unless right. they're specifically supposed to be different, they're like you know basic army troopers and then the elite army troopers. <laughs> you, yeah, and you better watch out for those elites as well because if the old republic has told me anything, three of those are supposed to be remotely funny. And these guys have brought a whole squad of them. Oh no! See, Republic Commando. Oh my God! And they're like nigh invincible. It's really hard to just make sure they stay down. Five mm. seconds later. Oh, that was quick. 
throwing up a bunch of arrows. Right, cool, I think. Can we get the murder dinosaur in front of me? We can have the murder dinosaur take the first turn. Just stand in front of the murder dinosaur. Just stand behind the murder dinosaur. Oh, see, are we opening up the other door too? Or No. no. We're, we're opening one at a time. Yep. Yeah. Those troopers are fucking amazing at this. To be fair, okay. the troopers have kind of had time to prepare. Also, why are we all in the uh, combat tracker still? Uh, from last time? I could have sworn we cleared it was all. People have revolved. Uh, well, yeah, oh, there was like... Bit. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. There you are. Right, has everyone gone in? Uh, no, we've got one last one coming through now. There we go. So we know. should have a 3.01, a 0. The, 0.4... Unless somebody spends rapid reaction, it, uh, the combat tracker actually does do what it's supposed to do now. Yes, that's the entire reason. Uh, we appear to be missing one, actually. That's I was about to say, A, we're missing one, and B, yeah, the GN NPCs actually are going first with a 4.01 rather than a 3.01. We're missing my 2.02. .02. 43 yeah. initiative, yeah. <laughs> They're <laughs> well, I mean, speed. It may as well be. <laughs> um, 3.01, was it? Not that it matters, given we all go after. Yeah, the 2.02, .02, but the, yeah. Given the circumstances, it doesn't matter too much. Alright, so you open the door, and there's a squad of angry troopers there. The door Hello! Door. Did we just get chair dozered? What? <laughs> Paid okay. it to one of the missions as he opened. Mm. Oh, and that then... guy! Jeez, I remember it. Didn't they patch him out yet? Why would they patch that out? I don't know. I played that mission loads recently and he never shows up anymore. That's what the fuck? The uh, so Tourist. Yes. It's your moustache, man. It draws so ugly. Uh, it should be a black dye on that. So difficulty yeah. on that. First of all, it should be difficult. And also a <laughs> black dye for my range defense. No, I'm not gonna. Sorry, I'm not trying to be a dick here, but there we are. He misses. Right. So they get two boost die? Yes, yes, they do. I'm actually gonna use uh, them. Will they gone. live to use them? Probably not. No. <laughs> so you want a jar to go first? Group. It's a single group, and all of us are going to be going through now. Let us see the murder dinosaur eat this guy. <laughs> uh, any, any upgrades or anything, Gray? No. I can't not these guys. You could always use the boost that. defensively, Gray. Yeah, actually I will. Use them as a setback. Oh, okay, uh, geez, uh, okay, Jeez, I didn't. Okay. Does it help them? At all? Um, yes, well... Okay, so yeah, the four threat. Um, I'm gonna put that in a strain. Obviously, jar falls over. <laughs> strain, you said. Oh, can I have cleared that strain from the fight on the planet? Oh yeah. Probably. Should. Well, if nothing else, you would have just rolled for it. But yeah, if he's saying clear it, then yeah, you've had more than fifteen sense. minutes. <laughs> it's fine. Everyone should have cleared that strain. Oh. Okay, so they're still alive? Yep, they're still alive. Well, Annoying. Two of them are. <laughs> you, you pick two up, smash them together, and then just throw the paste away. <laughs> <laughs> ah, well. the, the new Trandoshan Fall of Wall decoration. Hint of brain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody else come and make a fire them. Ox, do you want to finish this? So, um, who's got... Yeah, I was about to Nox say. Him, yeah. Nock's gonna I, finish the, If they uh, somehow yeah. survive Nock, I think Tybus and I should go, but I think Nock has it covered. Nock's gonna have go. not they have With not that, survived. He Nock. kills them outright. Yes. They're fucking Perhaps. gone. Not no, non lethal. I just like I hold my pole arm over their heads and I just like bring it down and they just fall over. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's they, a skull at the very fracture, least sure. are severely injured. No, I'm not trying to kill them, so they're perfectly knocked that out. Is non lethal? Non-lethal right. does not mean non-injuring. <clears throat> Fine, I walk up and I just slap a couple of binders on them and drag them back to the ship. They can join the crew. 
<laughs> no, they joined uh, the POWs. We're not playing pirates. That's what I meant. The crew is not, not the pilot the POWs. They can oh. join the Jedi. Okay, yeah. stack up on the other door now. <laughs> you see, this is the thing. We can, until we get to the central spoke at least, we can clear all of these doors as we go, assuming. Yeah. You're going to pop the other door as well? Uh, yes. Let's open up the next monster closet. <laughs> I'm not gonna be this thing. These guys must be going like, why are we why are we hiding away by ourselves in this room? What is even in this room? Why are we have got to die? Because I've always assumed that hut tactical manuals are not unlike 40k imperial manuals. In that, if you damage your equipment, you're executed. If you use your equipment in any situation, it's officially authorized. You're executed. So why bother dying in a firefight when you just sit at the back and wait for them to come to you? Yeah, look, the pay seems pretty great for being a hot trooper. Three shoot gray. Uh, six. So, any range defense there, uh, late? Who, who is, late. like, throwing coins around? It was yeah, Zebrin was lighting up. I was, I, see, I was, uh, muted for a moment. I'm gonna take the dodge incidental, so I have okay. one... So taking one strain, I have one range defense and upgrade your difficulty by one. Okay. We miss. Thank goodness. Uh, three advantage so, though. Yep. Yeah, Zex, do you want to go or should I? Uh, I want to go. Let me go. I I want I want to make sure that they uh know my, how much I appreciate this. Go ahead. Paul Buckus. Hey, poor buggers. Uh, so they are at okay, medium range. They have any range defense? No. Okay. Uh, I literally just here to die and be interesting. So that's two hits. They die. They, they got it. There you go. Evaporate. So both of these rooms you've just cleared are... Um... In one round, essentially. <laughs> yeah. Well, it is one minion group, <laughs> it, as it, and we're pretty high up there, so... Yeah. Alright, yeah, next... Well, and there is... What is in these rooms? Uh, there... More cargo? Yeah, cargo... <laughs> uh, a little bit lab, wrong. lab space. There's another bit. Um, you mean Tavis's long lost father is in the rooms? <laughs> oh, wow. It's not long lost. It's just, just you know, just long drunk. <laughs> He's not long lost. He died about six months ago. <laughs> anyway, um. It's basically, um, kind of labs and storage in these ones. Alright, so, gonna breach the next door? Yeah, sure. Alright, as this door slides open, you don't see some troopers. What do we see? Um, a rather, two rather large hulking black shapes. Don't like this. Let's go That's a good start. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Motherfucker! No. <laughs> Is that a melee Tom? Oh my that God. looks like a melee Tom, yeah. The well, went to the he never saw the first Star Wars campaign. Uh, the previous party thought it was a good idea to retrofit a load of random droids they found at the, you know, these roads called Toms. Sith no, droids. That's, no, a, that's a twin disruptor, no, by the way. We didn't retrofit them. We just used them as as is, and they had uh, disruptor rifles as standard issue gear. Point. Oh, no, no. Evidently, the huts have decided to retrofit them. Oh, well, you see, I'm actually glad, or well, um, not really glad about this because <coughs> disruptor rifles are. Oh my god! I thought you were going to use the dark troopers. Actually, me too. This These is basically our dark troopers. Yeah. Yeah, but this is. Well, yep. I, I I I'm sorry. I just really like the sort of <laughs> the the sort of the robot arms that you've just glued to their backs. 
look, when all you have is some super glue, you have to make adaptations where you can. That spent too, far too much time as well. <laughs> it's mainly fun. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Balance, you're not entirely wrong about what you said either. Yeah. Hmm? Last time we got compromising evidence against the Hutter Planet died. Yeah, yeah, that did happen. I think that it just more evidence for the go in and kill people approach works much better. <laughs> well, okay. not prefers not to kill people. It's like I used to work for the bad guys, so... Yeah. To be fair, if we ever ran into Nock, we'd be in a lot of trouble. Do you... rolling initiative again. I was about to say, do you want us to roll fresh in initiatives, or should we keep our old? That's a lot better. Question answered. Yeah, Mercy re roll and she's re rolled. Yeah, our only hope is that we roll really well and uh, we go far. I mean, well, we're already be doing fair, better, so. They've only got a 2.02 and a 1.01, so. Oh, previous rolls were better? Yeah, but theirs are now worse. Yeah, I was yeah. Uh, yeah, going to say. Yeah. I'm gonna take the one strain and make that into a 2.2. What, the 1.02? Yeah, the 1.02 becomes a 2.2. Yep, hang on. Okay, we got four turns. Okay, guys. Um, I well, can try we, to stun one. You know. I, the way I see it, we've got two choices. Either we can have the melee people try and tie up two men each to a droid if or to like stop anybody in the background getting shot before they can get to cover. You could try and burn them have down. Have the range guys try to burn them down deal. first. I, yeah. I have. Or we gap off truth. So I'm Sorry? going to use those. I think he said I have breach rockets. Yeah, breach rockets. Yeah. I would, yeah, I would like have. to at least try to burn them down a little bit first because, uh, I, again, I get benefits against people who have yet to go f during an encounter. Okay, just leave that last slot for me so that I can try to stun one. Yep. Okay, Which, yeah. uh, I mean, right. Gray is going to obviously, he's obviously thought about this since, you know. Yeah. Is someone going to pull out an iron grenade out of their pocket? <laughs> oh, you do have if those, there ever you? was a time, you know, that would be a thing that the, uh... You unfortunately, the person who can do that is Vex, who is going to instead shoot them. Oh man, I. I would shoot. I don't know what I could do. Shoot them. It would be very silly. It would well, be very, never very silly. Go I on. could spend two destiny points to dual wield ion grenades. <laughs> <laughs> would you throw them both at the same target, or could you throw one at each? I could throw one at each with Spitfire. <laughs> what do they do actually, though? Hold on. What does an iron grenade actually do to a droid? It's more it or less just it's it's a stun it's a it's a very damaging stun grenade specifically for droids. Well, may it not be better uh, to if just they have, shoot. If, if they have any cybernetics, uh, they is a it has disorient five, and if they have any cybernetics, they're automatically shorted out. My one worrying thought is that if you throw those, we are down to one light side token, and Gray has four before he even gets to shoot anything. Yeah. yeah. I say, and um, plus, do we like? I mean, we can, we can. I say, I can gun one down. We can certainly try to like, t as he knock out the other one. What's their blast rating anyway? Blast seven. Yeah, the, their base they damage is probably, ten. The ion grenade would probably hit both of them. No. Uh, if I got enough of a advantages, there's a lot of advantages I would need to get to do all of that. True. I mean, it works off of ranged light, which is good, but uh, there's a lot of advantages that need to go do that. I think so. you just shoot. I say, like, do you want me to do the Remember comedy the option, shit. or do you want to do the more realistic option? <laughs> like, can't you, can't you, do you draw them as a maneuver? Uh, I can draw them as an incidental because I have quick draw. I mean the grenade. Well, can, do, do you, can you produce them as a, for, with a maneuver? As an incidental. Well, then do that, and then somebody else uses their maneuver to take it from you, and they throw it. 